and welcome into Crochet Life and Stuff with Deborah Presents Me, Deborah with a Torrid Haul. No, this is not crochet. This is the Life and Stuff portion of the program. Um, I have got actually a dual Torrid Haul. I did one online. I had some Torrid dollars and I had some, um, like a $10 bonus and there was clearance and yeah. And then when I was out and about the other day, I actually went to Torrid. I know it does not do me a bit of good to have a day off work. Scissors, not a big box though, just a little box. Gotta open this up. Try not to slice myself or the clothes on the inside. Okay. And since I ordered this like several days ago, I kinda don't remember what I have. <laughs> you ever do that? Oh, goody, I'm glad I didn't buy another one of these. Um, this is, Wrapped in so much plastic. Ah. Okay. You see that I'm wearing skulls today. Well, there are more skulls. Look at these. They're floral. They're adorable. Yes. This was a, um, I think it was a Torrid dollars. I, it ended up being cheaper than what the price tag. So, so reading the price makes no sense. So there's that. Super cute. Love it. Okay. This one. Ah. I believe this was on clearance. Where in the world is the... Why so much plastic? Can't they just put it all in one bag? I mean, really. Being the middle-aged woman that I am, I think there's a, a requirement that I like animal prints because, well, I like animal prints and a lot of us do. Look at how cute this is. It's a tank top with buttons that don't really button anything. I mean, you can unbutton them, but there's no reason because there's nothing behind it. It's like a false, you know, placket. But yes, this is super cute. And I always wear tank tops, especially for work, this works well. And even if I have to be like super professional, I have like cute jackets I can put on over it or, you know, something I crochet. Hello. All right, there's that. But wait, there's more. Any uh, men folks or anybody who is um, embarrassed by seeing a bra, look away now because there is a bra in here. I won't be bottling it, but you know, just a bra. This was on clearance and I remember this was like less than a third of the regular price. And I got it because, wow, look at that vivid color. Cute, super stinking cute, right? And it's like a lace all over. It's not even like lined. No lining, no padding. There is an underwire because, you know, I'm a middle-aged woman. There will be underwire. But it's a push-up. It is it's strapless. You could make it strapless, it says. I don't see this one staying up properly being strapless. Maybe it will. Never even thought of trying it that way. All I saw was hella cheap on the bra and uh, it was in my size. And wow, I definitely don't have a bra this color. Got a lot of them over there though. A lot of bras. Okay. Oh, this. I got this. I don't know how it's going to work or if it's going to work. Got it on a whim, as one might say. Oh, plastic. Silica gel. Don't eat those. They even tell you on there. Don't eat them. Okay. This is a cat suit. I have not worn anything akin to a cat suit in over 30 years. Yes, this is a one-piece cat suit down to the ankles-ish. Yeah, probably down to my calves, but um, I have long, thick legs. But, yeah, it's a one-piece thing. I mean, it looks like it'll fit. Maybe it'll be like having a tank top on that's tucked in that won't untuck. Um, I often wear leggings under a dress or under a skirt. This will be an interesting way to try that out. I might try it out when I go to Bad World because we always wait until it gets cold out. So I'll have this on under something just to see how it works for me. And like I was reading in the reviews, there is a seam in the middle that somebody was like, oh, I didn't expect there to be a seam there, but that's just the way it's constructed. Um, and, and how do you tinkle? You take the whole stinking thing down. Yeah, good thing I have a bladder of doom. Okay, I won't have to tinkle like while I'm wearing this at all, ever. Okay, there's a little bit more. What did I get? Oh, 
some leggings that are tucked into this little tiny bag. Yeah, I bought some more leggings too when I was there yesterday. So apparently I'm going to be covered up in leggings. But these are probably high rise waistband, which I like in the leggings. Thicker fabric that smooths and flatters. I ain't going to smooth all of it, okay? i am tell you that right now. Cotton, nylon, spandex. But yeah, they come on this little hanging thing. There's a picture of kind of what they look like. They're just black leggings, y'all. There's nothing fancy here. But like I said, I wear leggings under a lot of stuff. And these are not leggings, but these are a crinkle fest. Oh gosh, all the plastic. Why all the plastic? The socks. Yes, this sock says badass. Okay, this one has skulls on it. The white ones are plain, I think, and there are black ones with stars. It is getting to be weather where I will need to wear actual shoes and not just my sandals, so I needed some socks, and these are made for people with bigger feet. These particular ones are for shoe sizes 10 to 13, which is unusual. I wear a 13, so socks that will actually fit. Socks, cute socks from Torrid. Okay, that was what I ordered in the mail. And that got delivered while I was out the other day. This is what I bought at the store. Y'all stop me before I shop again, okay? I had Torrid cash and that's a dangerous thing. First off, the skulls. How cute is that? Another t-shirt. Oh gosh, I love that. Um, what in the world did I buy? Oh yes, I got a dress. <laughs> yes, another dress. I, and I am going to do a closet call and uh, get rid of some stuff because it's time. Some of the stuff that I have that I wear, sometimes I don't wear it anymore and I've had it for years. It's just time to go. This is super stinking cute, okay? It's like a raglan style with the sleeves up like that, but it's a jersey material. It's stretchy, it's soft, it's got a little cinch in waist, and it is longer than the dress that I had on yesterday. So that'll definitely work. It goes down to my knees. It'll be cute with boots or with sneakers because yeah, I do that. But yes, another dress. What else is in the bag? Oh, you know I told you about more leggings? Got more leggings. These are the high rise capri leggings. Capri length because they didn't have any ankle length in my size. My size sold out. I wear a three at Torrid, which is like a three X. Um, yeah, but they even have this cute little design on the back. Okay. They are super, super like strong, stretchy, and you cannot see through these. If I put them up to the light, I've got a light there. I can kind of see that there's light behind it when I pull it apart and stretch it, but you're not seeing anything. So yeah, perfect for wearing when you wear leggings as pants with just kind of a longish shirt. You don't have to worry about showing your booty. All right. Now there's more, but wait, there's more. These are more athletic type leggings. Told you I wasn't next with the leggings. These even have pockets. Pockets, y'all. My phone will fit in there. Pockets on both sides. You choose your side. Strong. This is a little bit of a shinier material, but very breathable. And it's got the nice, thick, big waistband, and it's high-waisted. Yeah, which definitely helps me. I am what they call an apple shape. I'm round. Round is a shape, so I'm in shape. Uh-huh. Um, but these work for me better because they're a little bit more high-waisted as they stay up. If I get stuff that's more low-rise, it kind of starts way down here, it's just going to roll. It's going to roll, and I'm going to be hefting up my waistband the whole time I'm wearing it and I hate that. Also because I was feeling a little bit extra like really extra <laughs> here's some more leggings they're glittery y'all they are glittery they are shiny they have stars on them I don't know where I'll wear these unless I'm wearing something very plain and I might have these as a pop of color from underneath um, or if I ever get my lard butt back to the gym these will be good gym wear. But yes, this is cute. But not only, not only 
Did I get the leggings? Oh no. I told you your girl was extra. Sports bra. Okay. But look, you don't just have to put it over your head and hope that you can get it over the shoulders and everything. It unzips. Amazing, right? It's also a racer back, which I love. I'm not going to have to worry about straps falling because straps slide off my shoulders all the time. That's just how I'm built, okay? These will not, just by design. I am just thrilled to pieces. I might just wear this, this stuff around the house. It might show up in a video if I'm feeling really bold. Yeah, maybe if I have some tequila first. Maybe. Okay. Um, there is one more item in this bag. I made earlier this year an orange color, sort of a tangerine color, um, little ponchette to wear over things. Oh, that'll be cute over that bodysuit. Anyway, um... So, but I've never really owned orange colored clothes before, but I saw this and it just shouted to me. It spoke and it said, Deborah, you need this in your life. So Deborah has this in her life. Okay. It is sort of a fit and flare um, dress. Like I love to get from Torrid. Anytime they have a style like that, I love it because I have no waistline y'all. I'm shaped like an apple, not like an hourglass. Okay. But it's long. It actually goes down below my knees. So it will be perfect for the fall, but look at this color. Oh my gosh. That is a beautiful, it looks a little bit more neon on my camera, but it is actually a gorgeous orange color. And I put it up to myself and I'm like, can I get away with this color with my skin tone? I thought, you know what? With the right eyeshadow, with the right lipstick? Yes, yes I can. So yes, for the first time in my life, I have an orange dress. Wow. That's actually the end of the bag. Yes, I spent too much, but that is going to be the end of my Torrid shopping for a while. No matter how much more Torrid cash they try to throw at me. Okay? Seriously, y'all. But I'll pay that off next month and it'll be all good. Oh, and they're hiring for the holidays. I would never be able to work there. For one thing, my feet couldn't take being on my feet all day. Okay, for another thing, I would spend my entire paycheck there, y'all. There is no way I would get out of there having any money left on my check. Maybe that's why they hire people. They know they're going to spend all their money there. They don't lose anything. Ooh, conspiracy. Maybe not, okay? <laughs> Thanks for coming by. This is your first time here. Welcome. Welcome into the world of... Deborah's world. It, it's it's a fun place sometimes and it's kind of a zany place. Um, if you're new here, please hit that subscribe button. You never know what you're going to find. Hit the like button on your way out. Leave me a comment. Tell me how you found me and um, check the description because you never know what I might have missed that I'll put down there. Thank you so much and I will see you soon. Bye y'all.